welcome back to my channel welcome back to my channel my name is pedre as you guys know that in this channel we used to drop daily analysis on boom and crash and uh, step in this uh, strategy for you guys to enjoy daily taking trade on boom 1000 and crash 1000 uh, you see guys today I'm going to be dropping another best strategy for you guys which can really help you guys to take up a what a daily profit with this as you can see now I'm having a what a running profit on my trade uh, which is currently now moving my market up to what I want exactly but guys today I'm going to explain deeply inside this video how you can trade with uh with trend lines and the use and this great indicator for you to identify the right time for you to enter the market as you can see now this is crash 1000 on five minute time frames and also you can use this strategy also on uh, boom 1000 on five minute time frame so it works on boom 1000 five minute time frames and it also works on boom 1000 uh, on crash 1000 five minute time frames so guys let me explain how this strategy works before i show you the settings of this strategy in this video uh guys today there are two things that you need to do inside this video the first thing is to learn how to draw your trend line and the second thing is for you to know when for you when you need to enter the market so guys today i'm going to explain how you are going to be enter your market in whereby you are going to analyze your trend line which is what we have here and uh, we have our down trend line here and we have our indicator yeah which give us the right time for us to enter the market so for you to identify your trend line now uh what you need to do is for you to just wait for this uh oscillator line which is the red line here to move to our 10 level once it moves to our 10 level that is the right time for you to start your in the to start your trend line so you have that particular time that uh this level reach uh your or your 10 level that is when you are going to start your trend line you see you see now this is the level this is the level and you are going to be identified that uh, that horizontal zone uh, that uh, resistance zone and uh, you are going to be identify your what your support area which the market is going to respect so these are the area that you need to identify first so for me to identify all this this is exactly what I mean I need to wait for this uh, red line to move to my 10 level you see now the market have going downturn and this level now has be has jumped up a little bit so but before this level is 10 level is in 10 level so you want it to respect that 10 level like what is happening exactly here this is the right time for you to identify your trend line so at this level now you take your trend line up to this uh area you make it joint with the next uh rejection zone and you have your nine like this and also same thing we also happen here when you have your was rejection zone at this area you see now the market respect those rejection zone and keep on sticking down the spike and once immediately you take down the spike then uh you need to wait for the market uh to reach the 10 level like what's happened here and uh, when you are having your blue nine, which is the two moving average, the blue nine and the green nine, crossing the blue on the below level, that is the right time for you to enter the market. Like what is happening exactly in the market now. And that is the reason why I enter this trade. So this particular trade now, I'm going to trade it for some time. Uh, when I discover that uh, spike has started uh, able to come out, then I close my market. You can see what is exactly going on now you see now we are still in what in profit you see i've already make more than uh, i've already make five dollar now on this strategy you see that that is exactly how it works so uh, the same thing happened here let me show you what exactly happened here too you see immediately we are having the two moving average that is crossing uh when this uh, when this oscillator line reached the 10 level then this is the right time for us to take the trade. You see now, you are going to be taking that uptrend to your upper side. You see that it's going to favor you guys. So same thing happened here, guys. Same thing happened here. Same thing happened here. You see now, we are having our what our 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 last rejection zone at this upper area, and uh, it's reaching our ten level. And what you need to do is to wait for these two 
moving average the red uh, the blue one and the green one to cross over the red one and that is exactly the time for you to enter your trade so don't forget you need two things for you to identify uh, the first thing is for you to identify your trend line and when you are able to identify your trend line your trend line will tell you exactly the move of the market you see now when you identify the trend line at this particular moment now you can easily uh use this trend line now to cash down this particular spike because you know that it's going to respect this level you see that you know that it's going to respect this level you are is on a spike down you see now you can catch up you can use this to what to catch up a spike but in this video i'm only explain how you can use this to what to trade an uptrend successful on crash 1000 without any loss you see that you see now this is about um this is 47 uh, dollars account and you see what exactly is now more than five dollar in what in profit now so it's not going to work again so if you only are going to identify those points very well if you identify those area very well the first thing that you need to do is very simple what you need to first identify your trend line once you identify your trend line then you are going to look for your time to enter your trade you see we have an entry at this particular time which i did i take you see now it respects it a lot and it it, it, it it spiked down a little bit and give me that full uptrend before i close my trade and also i also you see now you see you can use this strategy to what to also catch up down the spike and from this moment now the reason why i'm taking this particular strategy is because i'm having uh, my oscillator 9 on the 10 level and i'm having my two average crossing this oscillator 9 which is the red one is the two moving average is crossing it and that is the reason why i'm entering the market at this moment you see that i'm going to enter it for more little time and before i think about what to do about it so you can use this strategy what to catch up a what a daily trade successfully you see now the in this the trend line will always help you to identify the right time for you to enter the market you see now at this particular moment you can see uh what you just need to do is to wait for that uh for that uh oscillator to reach your 10 level once it reach your 10 level that area is where you are going to be starting your trend line you see that i'll start i i start the trend line at this particular moment and it gave me an uptrend uh, uh an uptrend at this area you see now at this area you see so once it give me that it starts spiking on a downtrend so that's exactly what i want you guys to always do so you with this strategy now you can use this to what to pick up a lot of buy entry in the day so let me show you the settings of this strategy um uh, we have the oscillator here the first thing is oscillator we have the k period of 120 the t period of one the slowing of one and we have the price feed of close close we have the method to be exponential we have our two color to be in red in white which is the color of our background and uh, we have different level also uh, our different level is we have 10 we have 100 we have 90 we have 50 you just can it the way i show you guys so uh do we have the first three moving average the first one is period of one and we have red as our color here you just can shut it then we have the second moving average which is the period of 120 we have blue as our color you press under then we have our last moving average which is the period of 60 and we have green as our color here then you press on done guys you see now the market is still respecting that particular level you see now so you can use this strategy to just catch up a lot of daily entry on it so the same thing also work on what on boom 1000 the only thing you need to identify on boom 1000 is for you to uh to identify your what your your upper zone which is the 90 level so anytime you are having uh your oscillator on the 90 level and you have your two moving average that is crossing the red nine this is the right time for you to enter the market so you have the ability to what straight down the market in a very large way you see guys so apart from you using that uh, trend line and also if you are going to be using the trend line what you are you going to do you are going to wait for this uh, red line uh, to reach your 10 level and that is exactly where your uh, your your trend line is going to start as you can see now it start from this level 
so and uh, i bring it down up to this moment before i discover that there is a what there is a uptrend in the world in the market at this level and if you are going to be catching up the uptrend then you need to uh, to respect this level and you see that it gives us a what it uptrend so guys if you are watching this channel for the first time kindly subscribe to this channel and click on the notification button to notify you when next we uh we drop our next video guys so um